Guys, I am in grass right now. I'm joking. Hey guys, I'm in the video, Joy Kurt, and today I'm starting a brand new series of the channel. It's going to be called Let's Build. I'm just going to be building, really. It's kind of like my survival let's play series, just... It's not... I'm going to have a separate creative series called Creative Let's Play. I'm going to have survival let's play and creative let's play. I'm just going to have a Let's Build series. It's going to be separate. So I'd like... I usually... I'm not usually... A Minecraft usually play in creative mode, so I thought why not start some series on creative mode. And I think I'm gonna do two or three. I think I might do another survival series later on, but it's not gonna be survival play. It's gonna be like survival play but building at the same time. So whole goal is to like build stuff. I'll do like speed runs and stuff because why not? Oh, hey, that's, pretty, that's been pretty popular recently. Anyway, guys, today I just made a new world. Like literally just now, I had the footage if you guys don't believe me. And um. I am going to be building something pretty cool, but something I've never tried. So, a little backstory before I really say, oh, that's cool. A little backstory before I say what it is. I am a huge fan of samurai stuff, Japanese like warfare history, like when it comes to, like like the fe like feudal Japan stuff, like samurai ninjas, not like the anime stuff. I don't like anime. I'm gonna be honest with you, I don't. I'm not an anime fan. But I do love samurai stuff and the armor, the weapons, everything. So I was thinking, and I'm just gonna say I'm not good at it. Uh, what I'm about to say, I'm thinking, let's build a feudal Japanese village. Like this is gonna be very difficult, if not impossible, because for me I don't know how to like do the Japanese architecture, like the whole like um. I don't know. I just don't know how to do it. So, first of all, I want to build a small, like, little area fort. Like, get an area fort started. And then from there, we'll continue. So, I was thinking we can make it near the village. So, this can be, like, the... Like, right over here. So, first of all, let's come here. Set our spawn. Oh. So, our spawn point is set. Now we need to do the microphone. Excuse me. Put headset on. So now what we need to do is uh, put it to one side of it so I can hear what's going on around me. That's what I tend to do. So uh, we start to spawn. Now what I need to do is I want to make this look like Japan. How do I do that? I don't know. But there is one thing I can definitely think of, just to make like the forest and everything seem Japanese. Let's get some bamboo. I guess that's in Japan, obviously. Why not? Let's see. How do you actually put this stuff down? Oh, like that? Okay. Pretty simple. So what we're going to do is I'm going to put some bamboo around this forest. Just randomly. we make it seem a bit like it fits in here. So, make it like Japanese themed forest or something. I don't know what I'm doing, honestly. Also, be like one of those torty gates and maybe some shrines or whatever. I've been playing too much of Ghost of Tsushima recently, so... Probably gonna take some inspiration from that. Okay. Also do some birch trees, probably. More birch trees. I feel like that would fit in better. Some random bamboo around here. Probably should've done like a jungle biome, honestly. Might have been a better location for it. I was thinking... I don't know if I have the texture pack in here or not. I don't think I do. I think it's... It was on my old PC. I might be able to get it on my, uh... uh I might have it on my Xbox. So I could join the world. Or maybe transfer it over to... Through a realm. Transfer. And then download the texture pack pretty much just like it adds sucker trees if you don't have sucker trees it's pretty much like a, if you know cherry blossom trees and as well it's like pink trees places i think birch trees or pink trees and the leaves are pink and everything it looks really cool i don't have that so i'll do something else and that would have been cool but as i said we don't have access to that sadly what can we add what can we add to make this fit the theme. Honestly, I don't know. Uh, 
So let's let's get a look at let's see what we're working with. Like the area we're in and everything. So a lot of different biomes as you can see. Um We can just start off making a village, I guess. Right here we could do is we could build I have an idea actually. That's gonna be pretty cool. So we're gonna need I'm gonna try to build a Tory gate. Now I'm gonna be honest, I don't know how to build one. I tried building one a while back. It didn't turn out that great. Let's try building a Tory gate. And we'll lead into the nether. Oh. Oh. Oh, it's nice stuff. So, uh how do I do this? Um I don't even know where to start. <laughs> like it's last thing I wanna do, but I don't know what I'm doing. I'm not good at building Japanese style. So okay, you know what? Okay, let's just let's just start with the house. Basic house. Can't be that difficult. Probably is. I probably shouldn't say that because it probably is pretty difficult. You know what? I'm gonna. I have an idea. My PS4 is right here. My other screen. I have two monitors. I'm gonna turn on my PS4. We're gonna play Ghost of Tsushima at the same time. <laughs> you guys won't be able to see it, but I can. This video. It's gonna take a lot of work. But I want to make this cool. No matter how long it takes. Because it's probably going to take a while. Let's try the Tory gate real quick. I don't know what to do. That's why I keep going back and forth. Let's... What do we do? Okay. Let's just start right here. So... Do it six blocks. Well, seven, technically. Let's put it right here. This is not how you build a Tory gate, I'm just going to say right now. This is so bad. That's not even anything close to a Tory gate. This looks terrible. Apparently, a lot of other people playing Ghost of Tsushima have friends with right now as well. Um, what I want you guys to do, if I ever even finish this, I want you guys to rate my Tori Gate. Also, if you guys know how to build Japanese architecture, let me know and I will let you join this theory. You can be in a video if you know how to build a Japanese themed village. That does not look terrible, but it does not look good either. So my whole idea for this was that we make this into another portal entrance with a Tory gate. What? Oh, the portal's not even finished. What am I doing? It's the smallest portal you can make. Can you make it to... Like this? Like right here? Place the crying obsidian. Most of it, at least. You can. This might actually not look that bad. Never mind, I take it back, it looks terrible. <laughs> Doesn't look terrible, but there's definitely some improvements that can be made. Let's that right now. Portal is lit. Let's bring this down a block. Where it's not lit. Uh to where it's not visible. We should still be able to enter into the portal. That's not too bad. I don't think so. Could do a little bit more. It doesn't look terrible, but it doesn't really necessarily necessarily look good either. Get my PS4 controller. It's right here. I don't play PS4 too much just for this game. <laughs> Main reason I got it. So I'm looking at the our Japanese temple right now. How do I even? I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just gonna be honest. I have no idea how to do this. Could try. Well, might say dry. We could try this. Actually, this might work. So, foundation looks like it's some sort of stone. We'll use smooth stone. Let's see how how big is it. 
That could be one, two, three, four. Wait, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So, fourteen blocks of wood. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Wait, fourteen. And then the side. Might be 14 by 14. Yep, 14 by 14. That's how I'm gonna do it. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I'm gonna build this out. I'll put it right here. I build a small pagoda. I think that's what they're called. Might work actually. Now the roof is gonna be difficult though. I wonder how long it took people, like people back then, to build one Japanese pagoda. Probably months. But the thing is, they probably had help, so. I don't have any help. Maybe the same on the sides as well. Something is all right. All I'm gonna say. Oh, it's two away. Okay, I think I get it now. Uh, uh no, it's still three. Oh, I literally because <laughs> I made the same mistake twice. Put another window there. Kind of door on each side, but we're not really gonna do that. That gate looks really weird, but not too bad. Like it looks, it looks good, but at the same time, it looks terrible. <laughs> I'm being honest. I don't know what to think about it. Also, I hope you guys enjoy the new series. Um, I didn't know if I really wanted to do this because I didn't know how it would turn out. But I think it's gonna be alright. I think it should be fine. So we got kind of like the front of it started. Well, I'm gonna say this is all guesswork. But yeah, I'm looking at like, the game to try to help me. It's really just giving me an idea of what how I want to do it, but it's not really showing me exactly how to do it. If that makes sense. And yeah, I see this and it's helping me figure out how I want to build it, but it's not telling me really showing me how to build it. So I'm still. Difficult. Now for the windows, um, we'll use these. They're gonna match with it, so it's alright. They're on the outside, actually. to do this. I, I really don't. Like, I'm going into this and I've never built a Japanese style house or anything. So it's going to be like a five story pagoda probably. Based off the one from Ghost of Tsushima that I'm looking at right now. 
Um, so, we'll work on the inside after. Let's see what we can get from paper walls. Is there anything we can use? I guess the wool would be the only good thing. Like white wool. There's gotta be something I can use for paper walls. Maybe concrete pattern? No, I don't know. I guess birch trap doors would be the only. And birch doors, actually. We'll use. Pretty sure we'll use birch doors. I think I'll find something better. I hope I can. Yeah, as I said, this is the first time I tried building anything like this. I don't expect it to turn out absolutely amazing, but I think as this series goes on, it'll improve. This is gonna be like a series, its own series for a good while. I think I don't think I'm gonna do like I think I'm gonna do a good amount of episodes on it. Probably at the most like maybe 30. We'll see how it goes. I don't want to just. Like the thing, the mistake I made with SLP was I spammed it. I don't really want to do the same thing with this. Like what I mean by spam is like I kept uploading just SLP videos. I guess I did the same thing kind of with my BS Spectre, which is my BS Spectre channel, which is for honor. Or, well, I just spam. Or, well, I wouldn't say spam, but I upload for honor videos very often. More often than any other game. Uh, this channel, the reason why you only see Minecraft is because it's a Minecraft only channel. My bit switch channel is just for any other game other than Minecraft, and I kind of don't really upload anything else. And also, I, I've heard that you guys do want Minecraft Dungeons videos. I'll. Uh, you know what? I think I'll do that. One of the future videos. I have seen the Minecraft Dungeons. Also, I gotta say, the pink does look weird, but once I finish building it. I think actually this will turn out nice. Not even lying. Let's go inside on the ground floor and see how this looks, see how the lighting is. Lighting's not too bad. I'm inside right now actually. So what they have, okay. So it goes up on the inside like the roof sir. The the ceiling is raised. They have beams going across. It's like pink. It looks like pink. In the game, pretty oh, like a not really pink, but like a I don't know, some sort of off red in a way. I guess I was thinking, put the beams right here. So, I know it's a bit probably too many lanterns. But I think it's fine. So on the inside, what could this building be? And I know we're not done. We still have a lot more to do. And then what we're gonna do is we're going to build a katana. No, I don't know exactly how to build a katana. I'm gonna be really honest, I don't know how to build one. All I can think of is getting an odd. I, I I've seen videos and people building katanas in Minecraft, but that's a lot of work and I'm not gonna do that. Just yet. I don't wanna use Pistons. I want to do something simple. I guess we will. I'm not really sure how to use pistons like this. Not really sure if it's how it works or not.
Does he even work? I don't know how to do it, so maybe that's just why. Just me being stupid. I don't know. You know what? I'm gonna end it off here. I hope you guys enjoyed. I've been recording this for a while. I don't know what to add really. And we're not done with the Fogoda. This is gonna take a bit of time to finish. Probably about 20 more minutes. Maybe less. To finish the outside. The inside is gonna take a bit. But I don't know what I wanna do for it yet. So, leave you guys in the description. If you guys wanna see if you guys like this series. I mean, yeah, let me know in the comments if you guys like this series. If you guys want to see more of it and what I should build, add to this. Not to rate my architecture so far. I know the Tory gate doesn't look that great, but I know I need improvement, and I'm gonna do it. But there's gonna be some time. So hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like and subscribing. I do have merch now, so check out the link in the description to my website if you guys want to buy some merch. But shipping might be a little delayed though, because with everything that's been going on recently, like the hurricane and everything that's that hit Louisiana recently. So, um, fortunately I wasn't there during the hurricane, but, uh, it was pretty bad when I heard, so. I hope you guys enjoyed, as I said, if you did, leave a like, subscribing, share the video with friends if you want, and I'll be back sometime soon with another video. Bye guys. Oh, my camera just fell. That is not good. I saved it though, but the positioning was perfect, and now it's not. Good enough, I guess. I mean, the 